Good evening. I'd like everyone to close their eyes and I'm going to ask you a question. If a patient came into your clinic tomorrow and said they have tinnitus, would you know what to do? If the answer is yes, that's great. If the answer is no, by the end of this workshop, I hope you'll be able to answer yes. Very excited to be launching 69 new hearing instruments. We have nine new uh, tinnitus uh, hearing instruments. Tinnitus is, uh, is quite a, a problem in modern society and we're very pleased to have um, something new to add uh, to the armory of audiologists uh, to help treat these people. We have so many patients that suffer from uh, tinnitus and so getting some new tools is fantastic. Tonight we introduced the Oticon Tinnitus Sound Support Package. We're really leading the market in terms of what we're doing by working with tinnitus experts in developing both counselling materials that support the patient and also the clinician to give the patient the best relief possible for their tinnitus. As we're understanding tinnitus, we're learning more and more and being able to tailor tinnitus therapy to those individuals is very important. It's very important that we have a toolbox of different therapies that we can call upon and use different elements for different people. What I'm going to talk about tonight is uh, sound therapy. Now what I mean by sound therapy is use of sound for benefit of tinnitus sufferers. This is most definitely our biggest launch. Uh, we are launching a full new performance line. Something that is new to us is uh, the soft speech booster. We know that people with hearing loss are very challenged um, when it comes to making sense of soft sounds. For some people, soft sounds benefits them, helps them organize the sound scene. For other people, they're just identified as noise. So what we did through this sliding scale, you can control how much of that you want your client to hear. We're getting a lot of really great positive feedback from our customers. We're probably one of the few companies in the market that uh, is spending the amount of money required in research and development to, to come up with these new products. This results in um, better outcomes for the hearing impaired. At Oticon, everything that comes to market has been vigorously tested. They spend a lot of money in research and development. There's a lot of research backed in coming out with these new products to market. Looking forward to trying these new devices to see how they can help the patients and we're certainly really keen to get in and, and do that as much as possible.